Snapdragon is a processing platform uh, from Qualcomm that has uh, many things that truly differentiate it from uh, competing platforms. One of the key things is that it has a, an extremely powerful Adreno GPU. There's a huge ecosystem of game developers and games that are optimized to Snapdragon. Majority of the Android phones use the Snapdragon processors. All the Windows Phone 7 products use the Snapdragon processor. Sony Ericsson is launching a gaming-centric device and that uses a Snapdragon processor. It creates a lot of opportunity for the developers because once they develop and optimize that game onto the Snapdragon platform, they're able to reach a large audience, not only for the smartphones, but also for uh, tablets. I've been in the industry for 18 years. As a developer, what excites me really about working on the Snapdragon platform is that I can actually write really nice looking shaders, nice looking materials. That was not thinkable before. It's amazing. <laughs> Six years ago, we worked on a console for this and now we can do it on a mobile phone. That was a point where I said, okay, wait a second. Maybe we should do much more mobile work. So we kind of like switched our initial company target from high-end only to including mobile games. There's a whole market out there and it's not going away. Adreno GPU lets the game developers develop high performance, stunning 3D quality games on a mobile phone that's almost console-like. The Adreno and Snapdragon platform is changing gaming as a whole. One prime example of that is Desert Winds. It's going to be one of the first games out in the marketplace for mobile that you're really going to be able to see this epic type of visual effects. It's changing how we're developing, it's changing how we're distributing. And this is extremely important for the marketplace. Gamers and consumers get more games on multiple devices. That's really the key. Qualcomm, we take it very seriously, our role in shaping the whole gaming ecosystem. We provide a lot of different tools for the game developers. The Snapdragon chipset and the Adreno GPU are making game development much easier. The Adreno Profiler is an incredibly advantageous tool for developers because it allows them to see in detail what's going on at the GPU level and quickly jump in and, and you know take 
what might be a week's worth of debugging time and turn it into an afternoon. The Snapdragon mobile development platform is a tremendous advantage to developers because it means they're going to be able to develop on cutting edge hardware very early on in their development cycle, optimize early, and get to market much faster. Developers are going to love this. It's been a very exciting time for us, but the future actually is even more exciting. This year and next year, we will see phones powered by Snapdragon that actually have a 3D display. Things like augmented reality that lets you mix 3D with real scenes so that gaming experience for the users is that much more immersive.